first social of the semester. I am sushi today. Hi. We're on our way to Gastrolab. Yay! We're back at it again. We're taking a cross the bus. Hey guys, it's Thursday and I want to start my weekend in the life right now on January 26th because I am sushi today. I'm literally dressed up like nigiri because I'm going to a social and the social's like theme is dress up to the first letter of your name. So I literally made this sushi costume. Makes me look chunky, but you know, I wanted to do it because I thought it'd be funny and it's like super easy to make. Isn't it so cool? Like the lines literally look like the like tuna slash salmon. Then I got this like black ribbon that I just tied in the back and this comfy t-shirt is like literally five dollars at Walmart so it's like hell yeah but my hair just looks like poop kind of I don't know I tried something different and it definitely didn't work out so that kind of sucks I feel like I normally don't wear something funny like I never do I always am like something like I don't know cute this is my first time you know going out of my comfort zone So I'm back home for my first social of the semester and it was so fun. I feel like when you're in a sorority, you definitely should take advantage of everything that they give you and like all the opportunities and all the fun things. So I'm definitely gonna try to make it just every social, but we'll see, I don't know. I kind of hate like dressing up. Like I feel like it's so much effort, but when you do get into it, like I did this time, like it's fun. Like I thought the sushi thing was so cute and like so funny. I think our next social is squad goals and my whole friend group actually bought crayon shirts from our last squad goal themed event. I think we might just wear that again because it was $15 on Amazon. So it wasn't very cheap. If we can get like two wears out of it, that would be like prime because I don't think the first time we even took pictures in it. Hey guys, it's the next morning and it's actually Friday. I woke up thinking it was Saturday and that's why I like don't really like to go out on the weekends because or weekdays because it messes with my mind and it makes me think that tomorrow is like Saturday or Sunday I don't know it's just weird so I woke up like and I was just like playing on my laptop and then like someone texted me are you going to meal plan I was like oh my god I totally forgot it was even Friday and that I have meal plans so I'm kind of annoyed because I could have like went and got food if I had known earlier but I totally forgot and by the time like she said that it was just like too late right now It is almost 1 p.m. And I'm going to the gym with my friend Marisid and We are gonna do the Kayla it signs pre-training week three I don't think she's ever done it before but she's just gonna do it with me because Charlotte's at work And she doesn't get off until 6 and I don't really want to work out at 6 p.m. Like that late in the day, especially on like a Friday I hate working out even like at 1 p.m. Like I'd rather just get it over with earlier so we finished our workout, done with week three pre-training. And burpees suck so bad, but we're gonna treat ourselves to a Planet smoothie, and I'm gonna go shopping for Gasparilla because I still don't have an outfit. What's the weekend vlog without me taking a nap? I'm so tired. Went to Forever 21, American Eagle, and TJ Maxx, and I didn't find anything for Gasparilla. And I really wanted like black ripped jeans, but I had these black moto jeans, and I just felt like it was just a waste of money just to get the rips in them. I don't know. It was just like stupid. So I didn't get anything, which I guess is good because then I can just like try to find something in my closet and not spend money. I'm at Fujiyama with my little. She's sick and going Gasparilla. <laughs> Rally. <laughs> good morning guys. It's January 28th and today is Gasparilla. I'm on my way to pick up my friend Hannah. It's 7:24, and we were gonna go get Chick-fil-A like after we got ready, but then I was thinking like, you know, it needs to settle in my stomach before like I get on the bus to go to Gasparilla. So we're gonna go get Chick-fil-A now. So I had to sleep over with my little and Jenny last night and we had to wake up at like 6.50 to start getting ready. So I just did my hair really quick so it could set 
and then I'm gonna go do my makeup and I think I'll have time because I don't really take an hour to do my makeup anymore which is good <laughs> and we have to be there at 9 so I feel like all of you are probably wondering like what the heck is Gasparilla it's basically just a pirate parade and I don't really know why it's such a big deal but last year I went and I don't know I guess it was fun like it was a different experience it's kind of cool because people get buses to take us there and back and that's like a two-hour drive um, one way and all you have to do is pay $20 which is not bad at all like a round trip to Tampa is $20 on a bus that's so cool it's just cool to see like a different like city and I've never been to Tampa before this Gasparilla event last year so it was really pretty and I really want to go back actually like a whole weekend with like Ryan that would be so fun because I feel like there's still a lot to explore um, but like all the roads are blocked off so like if you try to uber anywhere like it's so expensive I heard and there's no cell service anywhere because there's so many people there it's kind of like Mardi Gras I guess I've never really been in Mardi Gras either so I don't really know but the people on the parade floats they throw beads to like the people in the crowd ready for Gasparilla round two for us Yay! We are on the bus! <laughs> we really got on the bus. Well, we wanted to go on bus one because we heard it was like it's gonna be the most fun. But like literally we got on and then the bus driver was like, like there's no seat. We had like a day to go to Yeah, it was like, of course, we just want to be there already. Later. We're back at it again. So the parade is over, and there's so many bees on the road. <laughs> Climbing the trees. Wait, the trees right now. I need that one. <laughs> Yo, get Kenneth to get it. Lexi, ask that really tall guy. So we're literally shopping on the side of the road because there's like, like it's smoking in this bus, and it smells just so bad. Like, we don't know what's going on. So, of course. That's what people do when we stop on the side of the road. They just go, go up on the bus. Go on the bus. So, update they're kicking us off the bus. <laughs> and it's really cold outside, so we're going to shut the bus. Getting on another bus. Now. Yeah! We're finally moving. And we're on our way back to Orlando. And we literally could have been home by now. So, it is 9 21, and I got home at 9. And we left. Gasparilla at like six. A one and a half hour car ride took three hours. When the bus started smoking, it smelled so, so bad. And then I felt like super nauseous. Other than that, I think that this Gasparilla would be deemed successful. I am just happy to be back. Like I'm about to take on my makeup and just get snuggled in bed. I feel like nothing's going on right now, so I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, guys. It's Sunday and it's really gloomy outside, so I'm guessing it's super cold. So I have this like big giant sweater I got from Goodwill on and I'm about to go to my sorority house for like a lot of meetings today so if I don't vlog a lot like I'm sorry but <laughs> I feel like Sundays are just like my whole day of meetings um, so it's not gonna be like incredibly fun so I'm done with one meeting two more to go actually like three <laughs> look how cute you look <laughs> 
Yeah, I'll hold. I love that camera. I wish I would have gotten that one instead of my big oh, ass wow. one that I've never used. <laughs> We're at Brooklyn Water Bagels and it's my first time here, so I'm excited to try it. This is what it looks like. I got the Brooklyn, it's like the original, I guess, and I got a blueberry muffin for, you know, in my meeting, so I'll probably get hungry, so I got that for later. I'm back home and I'm done with all my meetings. It was just for my sorority. And now I totally forgot that the Miss Universe is on tonight, but my sister just texted me and reminded me, so I like grabbed my remote and turned it on. And if you guys didn't know, I did two pageants. It was um, Miss India Georgia teen pageant, but it was a cool experience because I met so many other like Indian girls and not like my community because it was actually kind of far but I still like talk to those girls sometimes and like you know I'm friends with them on Facebook and it's just cool to see like where everyone is now but I mean if you're looking to do a pageant like I totally recommend it it's a really cool experience like yeah people are against it like it's so girly it's like whatever and I feel like you gain a lot of confidence like you are going up on stage in front of like hundreds of or thousands of people you know so Thank <laughs> you. 